Can we talk about how dry the Euros has been? Dry. 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 For sure. Hella zero zero ga- goals. It's not it's, bro, group stage did not live up to expectations. No, nah, I'm gonna not. be I'm gonna keep it a buck. I think it's because of the format. The format, I think they bro, they need to chalk this third place woke nonsense. <laughs> it's it's nonsense, bro. Third place, four out of six third place teams going through. Did they reduce the groups? Is that why they did that? I think they took out a group and then did that. That's that's the only way. Bit weird though. I don't know, bro. I don't know. It doesn't. I, maybe I think they took out two groups because four teams, four extra teams go through. So they must have taken out two groups or something. It's ridiculous, bro. Woke nonsense, <laughs> killing the spectacle of group stages. But Fairs. knockouts are here. We're doing our predictions. We know the matchups. This is gonna be spot on. I'm actually confident. I'm mad I'm confident. confident, but I don't know if you're gonna. No, no, no. <laughs> don't mess agree. up my predictions because I, I know, know if you're gonna agree. Because mine are spot trust on. Trust me, I've been calculating, analyzing. Word yes, <laughs> and I know I know which is which. Bro. Okay, what's the, I want to go chronological order? Chronological. Yeah, yeah. What's the first game, bro? What's okay, the first game? First game is going to be Italy and Switzerland at twelve p.m. Eastern. Easy for me. Easy for me, bro. All right, I'm going Swiss. I'm going Switzerland. I'm too. going Swiss, bro. That's easy. I can't. All right, Italy, bro. Spalletti. I don't know what he's doing. What Hold it, up. I. Hold up. <laughs> Those were your boys back in our last prediction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay? Look, hear me out, though. With If I if you, if you put me in that managerial position, I might win Euros with Italy squad, with the Italy, Mate, Italian squad, bro. You can say that about England, though. Like, we've known yeah. this was going to happen. I don't get so it, So, therefore, bro. you make that prediction. Why is, how is Spalletti going from winning the league with Napoli Mate, to putting fluke. out these horrid 11s? It's fluke. Horrid. It? First of all, coaches... It's definitely a way different game, league versus tournament. True. Ball. So yes. we all know that, all right? I, I agree. Conte proved that he's a tournament ball player. Yeah. Ball coach. Spalletti doesn't look like it, bro. Well, no, Conte tournament ball. He uh, won the league. He made Inter? it super far with the most bummy English, Italian team of all time. True. Wait, he was the Euro? No, he didn't win it, but I'm saying back in the Who day. Who is the Euro? Who is the coach for Euros when, when Italy Mancini. won? Mancini. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mancini was the one, but. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I as I knew like Skamaka isn't gonna hack it, bro. He wasn't like, even. He's not even playing. He played the first couple games, bro. Broski, like it's ridiculous. They don't <sighs> have good attackers. It's simple as that. Yeah, it's simple as that. Yeah. Um, Califori, Califiori cooking. That's like their only bright spark. Donnarumma is having a good tournament. He's Donnarumma's always he's having. Al- he always cooks the in the best tournament. in the Euros, bro. I don't know. He's having one of the best tournaments. Yeah, but for me, Switzerland, bro, they've been convincing. And I told you, I say in, say in that same video though, I said Swiss are going to cook. They yeah. got a Kanji, he who has probably been top um, three player in the tournament, top three player in the they, whole tournament. No one is talking about him. Just so, just because they're no, no one's talking. I'm watching. I'm the one watching. I see a Kanji. <laughs> no, he's no. pulling. He's he's. Listen, Switzerland is on a good. different level. It, they're okay. Like they're good. They're very good. But you know, I don't know. We'll have to see where they land for the next predictions. But yeah. Switzerland for sure. I think. All right. Next. Next up, I think it's gonna be the host Germany versus Denmark. Easy one there. Germany yeah, just Germany. cooking. Bro. Germany's cooking. Mustiala is on a different level. He's Germany's on a cooking. different level to his peers. The guy, bro, he's just... No, like, he's good, for sure. Tony Cruz has been absolutely insane. Uh, it's going to be hard for... Her. It's strange that he's going to retire, but I, I would do the same. I'd retire on top as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, for sure. I, I agree with retiring at the top. Zidane did it best. No, nah, he, he was... He was... He was... He was, <laughs> he was what? Level. <laughs> he was geezer <laughs> level. No, no, no. But Denmark, dry. Denmark, dry. D- Denmark was in that dry group, the driest group of the group stages. Yeah, 100%. They don't really I got, don't really see them. They don't got anything going for them. Nagelsmann is cooking. He's getting the best out of the team. I'm trying to, rem- I'm trying to think. Like, full crew coming off the bench scoring. That's full my crew. guy. That's my guy. Yeah, but now I don't, not anymore. I don't understand. Garassi. The, Garassi. How, are they, how are Dortmund signing Garassi when they've got full crew going? I just don't make right, sense, bro. Let's, Get Let's, some no no no. Someone needs to get full Krug, and the manager needs to get him and like put trust in him, bro. Put some trust in him. Put some confidence well, in him. What's a new manager because now? Because full Krug, yeah, Sahin, but like Nuri Sahin and Peace Check. Yes, but they got they got Garassi, bro. I, and a different a different manager from a different team needs to pick up full Krug and get the best out of him because he I is don't know about that. he is a gem. He is this a, is crazy he is, talk. He I'm is pretty a, sure he, he had like a, one or two goals in the league. What? No, that's not yes. definitely not true. Yes, definitely bro, not I true. Swear. He's a dying breed, the pure nine, big man up top. He cooked in the group stages, coming off the bench. I think Nagelsmann should start him. 
Um, but they're going to go through regardless yeah, he of who starts. 12 goals, 8 assists. Oh, league. my God. 20 GAs? Pff, ridiculous. Ferris. But, yeah. All right. Germany, Ferris. Next next game. Uh, next game, we have England versus Slovakia. Okay. This is techie now. We're getting to the techie ones. Because Slovakia no. weren't too bad. They are pretty bad. Slo- Slovakia no, not I think too bad. I think you're mixing up the, the, they won't, the no, countries. No, maybe. this is Sesko's team. This is Sesko's team, right? Or Or is that Slovenia? Actually, it's not Slo- It's not Sesko's team. Oh, okay, no, I told Ferris, you. Okay, fair, fair. I was mixing them up. Slovakia, they've got Lobotka. They've got they've Dubrovka. Got, they've got Lobotka. Lobotka, yeah. who has had a very good he was tournament. Good. He was good in the Kuchka, but like I said, it's just one of them ones where it's like no one's paid attention to Slovakia. Yeah. They kind of just weaseled their way in. I think England, even though England has been frauding, like frauding. crazy. Madness. Gareth, I think we're on your head. Through. I think they'll see it. Yeah, through. I think England got so fortunate with this with this uh, draw here because Slovakia, yeah, they're not they're not really likes that. England, I think they'll barely get through. They'll scrape through. I think it'll be like a 1-0 again. I don't, think, I don't think England, with their current, with, with Southgate and his current philosophies, are able to score more than one goal in a game. Nah. It's or, ridiculous. Or I could also see like a very big thrashing 4-0, and then all the English fans are hyping nah, up. Nah, I don't see oh, it. Oh, now we're round to 16, and then something bad's going to happen. I don't but. see that happening. You know, it really depends what 11 he puts out. I just don't understand the ideology of... You know, no Palmer. I think Saka left back is a good shout. I'm not even trolling. <laughs> I'm not even trolling. Like I, people, like Arsenal I ha- legends are saying it as well. It's ridiculous. To be fair. It's not a bad shout. Why not? You know, England are struggling to score goals. Trippier is not the same attacking threat on that left side. You got to put Saka there. Allow Palmer to have some minutes. It makes sense. Obviously, it's a bit risky. But it makes sense, you know. You got to take some risk maybe to win the tournament. Yeah, the me- midfield ha- the midfield change. hasn't been gelling. I saw a stat before the third group stage game: Foden and Kane linked up once in 180 minutes. One pass between them in 180 minutes. It's mad. There's such a disconnect between the front three yeah. and the midfield. 100. percent Manu probably needs to come in somewhere. Um, I think Manu is definitely a bright spark Cole Palmer as well because he plays literally vibes FC at Chelsea so yeah. like they need someone like that and that's what that's what group knockout yeah knockout in the ter- ball in is international vibes tournament is it's, it's vibes so there's no tactical merchants like yeah like it's Matt I think Gareth he's just overthinking it like like always you know putting Gallagher in obviously the Trent experiment failed been saying for years I don't know how many years that Trent cannot right, relax play okay no, no, no. everyone's been saying that no 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 whoa whoa not don't everyone be saying, don't, like, don't generalize don't be saying this was a good idea don't, bro don't tell me that people weren't saying for years that Trent can play midfield he's a midfielder look at his passing don't I don't t- know who these people are bro well, there's a reason well, I heard he it. started in midfield and got moved to right back for a reason bro well, when it, for who? As a youngster. Oh, bro. as a youngster. Like, yeah, I'm there's saying. There's a reason for that. I'm saying. Like, like, it's not like he can't come uh, back any, in. Anyway, regardless, I've been saying Trent can't play midfield. It got proved this tournament. Um, yeah, dead dead baller in the midfield. He put in Gallagher. That's failed. You know what I'm saying? It, but it's not a... I don't know. It's him, bro. It's not the players. Yeah, like. it's not the players. When you when you got the pl- Premier League player of the season not playing at his best, it's clearly not yeah. not on the players. When it's, you got the Ballon d'Or contender and Jude Bellingham... <laughs> not playing at his best, yeah, that's a problem. Well, I mean, I agree. I I rate I rate Jude. We all know this, but anyway, let's move on. I don't know if now. you do, mate. Let's Next up, we got Spain versus Georgia. I think this is probably the most intriguing mm. round of sixteen game. It could no. Nah, I think second. it is. I say second. Nope. I think <laughs> Georgia is having an absolute time. Yeah, Kavara, my dog. Despite what did you say about Kavara this season? Calling him fraud, calling up, him out on up. his lower. Form this Hold season on. because of Napoli, bro. Can we talk about Materazzi. it? Materazzi. Can we literally talk about it? Hold go ahead, on. Go ahead. You're talking about it in terms of the game versus Portugal. First of all, a couple stipulations. Portugal's already in. They had already topped the group stage. Did not try. A lot of their players were attacking. Did not trek back. A lot of space for Scalia to do something. That's the reason why he shined. But I'm not taking away from Georgia as a whole. In Don't act like he party. wasn't good in the first couple games, too. He was okay. He was good. He was good enough for Georgia to actually advance into the round of 16. But with that being said, I'm seeing hints of Morocco-type World Cup campaign with with Georgia. I think they've got a really good squad. Goalkeeper is probably goalkeeper of the tournament this so far. far. He has an absolute, like, insane video going around on Twitter, like... Bro, he's like him right now. Yeah, yeah. Georgians love him. Yeah. I think he's just having a great game. I think there's a couple of players that are playing in like the championship that are 
that are on they, that team that's doing well as well. They've got the guy who playing in Liga. I forgot for who. Um, I think it's Maybe. Met. Met. He's I playing for Met. I think he had fair. like 14 goals in the league in Liga, and he's the he's the other guy up top that he looks mad Algerian, bro. And he has like the you know the beard. He, something I, like I don't that, know how bro. to pronounce his name. I'm not even gonna, gonna try. But I mean they've been cooking, and obviously they're playing Spain, who have been probably the best team in the tournament. So very you, good. You got very the, dominant. You got the biggest surprise versus the best team in the tournament in this matchup. But um, I think the matchup itself is good for footballing fans. Yeah, I think Spain is very attacking. Georgia is also very attacking. True, they're not. They're not. And scared. we already saw Turkey versus Georgia was probably game of the tournament already. Probably. And I think Spain and Georgia are gonna have that nice, you know, blend of good football, no tactical ball. Just I know. Vibes. I mean, Spain are gonna dominate the ball. We all know this. Um, I don't know if there's gonna be mad goals in the game. It depends. I mean, Georgia have nothing to lose. You know yeah, what I'm saying? This is their first time in the Euros in general, and then they made it to the knockouts. Huge achievement, but I think it's a no-brainer. Yeah, 100 It's a no-brainer. Spain's going to win. They're going to have enough to beat them. Uh, we can move on. France versus Belgium. <clears throat> okay. Now, this is going to be a stinker, bro. It's not going to be a stinker. I, I think, think it's going to be a stinker. I think, okay, this is a rematch of 2018 World Cup semifinal. And but this is like way out of prime. Like yeah, this I mean, is Mike Tyson versus. Like <laughs> this is six years later. So Roy Jones Jr. Yeah, type yeah. Beat. So I mean, look, I think this is a no-brainer. Look, France have been under. They've not played at their best this tournament. Mbappe one pe- one penalty goal fraud. Yeah. Um, Conte's been the man of the match. You know, if Conte is your best player, something's wrong with the squad. But you're, fair dues to Conte. Yeah, you know, he's been fair playing dues. well, but if Conte is your best player with all the talent you've got in the squad, then there's clearly something not going well. I could say the same about Belgium. If KDB is your best player in that squad, <laughs> there's something wrong Shut with the your hell squad, up. Bro. Shut the hell up. That brother with, with how KDB is playing, he would be France's best player. No, I don't. He would I be disagree. France's best player. What's um, their head-to-head? France has got two wins, draw and a loss against Belgium as of late. Um, look, I mean, at the end of the day right now, Belgium is literally the Argentina of the Euros. You know, they have a squad who are just looking to Belgium. feed the ball to their best player. They're just looking to that. feed the ball to their best player. That's what that's if you've been watching the Belgian games, you can see the the body language of the players when they get the ball, dude, they're looking for KDB. They're looking for Kevin. They're looking at where's Kevin? I got to find him cuz that's the only way we're going to win this game. That's that <laughs> that's been the game plan and, and that's that, resulted and in that's a, a good loss of Slovakia, hold on, a hold tie on. to Ukraine. <laughs> Like, Hold I don't on. Know it's a good you, it's a good game plan. It's probably their best game plan. It's probably their best game plan. It's probably their only chance. And but I don't know if it's gonna it's if it's gonna be enough. You know what I'm saying? In the group stages, they only got four points. Their fans were booing them. Their fans were booing them. Their fans were booing KDB. How dare they? How dare you, Belgians, boo your best ever Vamos. player? Boo your best ever player. Best ever players crazy. Ridiculous. Nope. Ridiculous. Nope. Um, but yeah, I mean, you know, it's it's a bit of a mess. But I think France is going to have enough. I just don't think... Whoa, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. What did you just say? I said France are going to have enough. Oh, okay. I thought you said don't have enough. Come on, man. I was about to say. Relax. I was going to say, I just don't think France is just... I didn't think they took the group too seriously, bro. I think they're just... can't say that, bro. That's, that's, that's a bad I, argument. I can. What Everyone's trying, bro. They've got Barcola, you know, trying everything. They've got Dembele trying everything. Barcola's not starting, bro, next game. Yeah, he will. Nah. Yeah, he will. Nah. He has to. Definitely not. I don't believe so. Turam's going to play striker. Mbappe nah. left. I don't know. Maybe. Dembele, right? I don't know. Maybe. I just think France is going to be easy because we all saw the French games. It was a bunch of parking the bus waiting for France to actually do something. I don't think Belgium's going to do that. You know, Feist is saying that they're confident. Saliba also said that they're confident. I think France goes in yeah, pretty I think easily. France goes I, don't, I don't think it's going to be... It's easy. I think it's going to be a good game. I think it's going to be close, but I think France is going to have enough. Easy. Next up, we have Portugal versus Slovenia. Okay. Now, Sesco's this is team. your boy. Sesco's team. I do like Sesco. I do rate Sesco. Um, he was a threat in the group stages. Didn't really get on the score Didn't sheet. Didn't really do much, though. But he was a threat. I watched the games. Um, Portugal, I'm not convinced. Still not convinced. Been saying it. Been saying Can't it in say our last that. video. Portugal are not convincing. They smoked Turkey when they tried. 3-0. Turkey, you're not convincing, bro. I don't rate Turkey wow. like that. I do not rate Turkey like I that. I think they're better than Slovenia. By a landslide. I don't know if they are. I uh, actually don't know if they are. By a landslide, they are. I mate. actually don't know if they are. What are we on about? Let me check Slovenia's matches. Yeah, they tied ahead. England. Mm-hmm. Not very impressive. Given defensively, England. defensively, they were good. They tied Serbia. Not good. Not a, Serbia yeah, was not a great look. Reeking. Yeah, Serbia reeked. <laughs> they tied Denmark. 
Yeah, yeah. And that's been defensive. Three clearly, games. defensively, defensively, okay, they've been so, good. So Very where? Good. Yeah, obviously they've got O Black. Yeah. In goal, and then that's pretty much it in terms of uh, defenders I know on this team. And O Block has been was good in the group stages. Very good in the group stages. Listen, it's a Look, bunch of randoms. I on get this that. Team. I get that. And I think they're gonna play. They're gonna you know they're gonna play their game plan. They're gonna probably sit back. And it's going to suit them very well because Portugal, against a low block, reek. Absolute stink it up. I'm not disagreeing. Stink it up. That's the that's the blueprint to beat Portugal. We saw it in the World Cup. Morocco did the exact same thing. And, you know what I'm saying? That's the blueprint to beat them. And I don't think it's any different. I don't think Ronaldo is going to be able to, to hack them. Bernardo I Silva. So. Bernardo Silva. I don't know, man. Bernardo Silva last six months. <laughs> it's been that's your boy. It's you been know? a little spooky. That's your. It's boy. been a little bit spooky for for B Silva. Um, Bruno, we all know about Bruno. Bruno against a low block. You know he's just gonna hit every single shot or or long ball to Rose Rosie, and you know that's gonna be the story of the game. I think Portugal gonna, gonna have possession, and I think like, if Slovenia can frustrate them. Mm-mm, I not think, enough. I do think it's going to go to Penzo. Portugal though. has way too much firepower. I do think bench. it's going to go to Penzo. Conceição has been an absolute sprite spark for Portugal. He's actually so good. No, Pedro Neto has. Pedro Neto hasn't been good as Conceição. Conceição, you're not even saying his name right, bro. I don't. I'm. I'm. <laughs> chill, all right. <laughs> he scored the winner, bro. Uh, against who? Against the, the first person they played, bro. First team. Yeah. Czechia. Two one. Quint- Conceição. It was the Pedro Neto assist, bro. Mate. You speak bro, Portuguese, mate. That's a hard word. That's a hard name, mate. <laughs> um, He's been yeah, a bright okay. spark. Union affairs. They got so much talent. Union affairs against Slovenia. I think, I think they will go easily through. dominate. I don't know about easily, but against Slovenia, okay, fair enough. They go through. Dominates. No upset so far. No is upset. That, so is far. that it for round sixteen? Actually, no. no we have one upset. Um, for, well, hold on. No, we're not done though. Yeah, we still got two more. All right, next up we got Romania versus Netherlands, and I'm gonna ha- go ahead and say it. I think Romania wins. No, it's not happening, bro. Why? It's not How? happening. No, no, no. Romania topped that group that you were talking about that you were cooking. Belgium, Ukraine, whoever else was in there, can't remember. Slovakia. It, it was a mid group. That, that they topped it. Fair play, four points was enough to top that group. Okay, and Netherlands and, didn't top their group. Yeah, yeah, but Netherlands been free scoring, bro. Been free scoring. Gakpo back to his World Cup form. He's looking very confident. You know what I'm saying? But that's the only person that's doing something in the Netherlands. Virgil van Dijk hasn't had a great tournament. Yeah, Memphis Van- Depay is just an absolute joke, man. Why? With the bandana, the headband. <laughs> he thinks he's bro, him. He's, he scored. He scored against Chavi Austria. Chavi Simmons isn't being utilized enough, I don't think. I agree. I think, what, who's the... Uh, it's Coleman. No, I know, I know it's comb and blood. What? Someone got hooked in the thirtieth minute. Veerman got hooked in the thirty-fifth minute. So, they have zero midfielders besides Reinders. Reinders, Chavi Simmons. Chavi Simmons is playing on the right. I just think that they're attacking wise. They've been better than I think most people expected them to be. Defensively, Ake's been very good. Uh, Van Bruggen's been very good. Like defensively, I think they can maybe just turn it on a bit in the knockouts. Seal up the back line a bit because they've been leaking a bit uh, too many goals. Nah. They're attacking attacking wise. They've been very good. I think they'll be able to. Get I think past Romania. Bro. I think the crowd is going to influence this game a lot. And bro, name a, a, name a Romanian player. I beg you. The center back for uh, oh yeah, Dragusin. Yeah, Dragusin was good in the in the group stages, but look, still, I'm telling you, it's just one of those teams. I think the crowd's going to play a huge effect, factor. A lot of Romanians are going to show up to this game. Why? Okay. I don't think a have lot of Dutch. Seen, have you seen the Dutch fans at the Euros? I, I don't they've think been, the Dutch are going gonna, mad. But not as much as Eastern it, European teams. It don't bro. matter, bro. It does matter a lot. I just think, for whatever reason, Romania is having a Cinderella tale. I can't back that. And I... Mate, it's not so cookie cutter that all the good teams are going to go through, I bro. hear that. That's why I wanted Slovenia through. Nah. I'm I'm going Romania, mate. Bro, we can't just go... I'm Broski. I think it has to. I think if anything, just, the Netherlands just, is just, gonna crumble under it's pressure. It's just too bait. It's too bait. It's not bait. I think that's not bait. It's too bait. I don't think that's bait it's at like all. It's like too bait because like Romania, oh, they topped the group with Belgium. It's too bait that like people think that they're gonna go on some Cinderella it's run. It's too now. bait that the Netherlands are gonna win. Nah, it's not because though. everyone thinks they're gonna win. No, no, no one thinks they're gonna win, bro. Uh, this what? Your, your pick, your pick, your Romania upset. Everyone's been saying that. No one has been saying. Trust that, bro. me, bro. Everyone's been saying that. Consensus seventy percent. 
think Netherlands is going to win on foot mob. All right, we'll go Netherlands, but I'll remember this. Yeah. Remember this. I said Romania. Yeah, okay? yeah, well, I'm confident about that one. All right, All right, Austria, Turkey, lastly. And for me, this is easy. Austria going Austria. through. Yeah, yeah they've, they've been, been they've insane. been convincing, bro. They've been convincing. Good game, though, I think. It will Turkey's be Turkey's going to be okay. It will be a good game for sure. Because these are. I feel like these teams are quite evenly matched. But I think that Austria is forming the group Ralph's stages. got them cooking. Yeah, no, Ralph was cooking. CR7. He's eating his words. Nah, He's chill. eating his words, bro. That's not, that's not CR7, bro. There's it a is. lot more people at CR7 United, criticized bro. him heavily at Manchester United. Um, but yeah, Turkey, Turkey, you know, they had the, they barely scraped through in the groups. I don't think they're going to have enough. Barely, though? It's it's unfortunate because they were dealing with like a lot of injuries no, and stuff. No, but bro, did you, that, that uh, Turkey game against... Who did they just play? I think it was Slovakia or something. I don't remember. Whoever, Slovenia. Oh, no, the, they played Czechia. That the game against Czechia, bro. Czechia got robbed. They should have had a pen. I think they, they uh, the ref yeah, called Czechia. a foul. The ref called a foul. Two red cards on, on them. Two. Oh yeah, one was after ninety minutes though. And um, yeah, the, the they so against ten men they barely scraped through. Czechia got robbed as well. Yeah, I, I'm not. I wasn't convinced by Turkey. I think Austria got this. Yeah. Quarterfinals. <clears throat> All right, let's just go top to bottom. Top to bottom. Spain, Spain Germany. Germany. This is a mad matchup, and uh, probably the two best teams in the tournament so far. So far, bro, what are we saying? It's super tough because Germany did not look convincing. What last game? Last game they tied. They were they, they were already top though. Yeah, you could say the same about Portugal and you were yeah, and you, Portugal. and you made that argument for Portugal. But so I was gonna say energy. I was gonna say they didn't look like they were trying. But Spain did the same thing and battered. So I don't know. I think I'm going. I'm going Germany. I'm sticking before, to my guns before Germany. I said Germany, but. I'm sticking to my guns. I'm saying Germany because I think that, you know, Spain were obviously convincing in the group of death, but I think that Croatia, you know, were I think this were goes geezers. PKs. Maybe. I think this goes PKs. Maybe. But I think Germany go through. I'll, I'll go Germany, but I think Calma. this is super, super tight. Yeah, for sure. Probably going to be the best game of the Euros. Portugal, France. I think it's Portugal. Yeah. Whoa, no, 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 no. I think it's we're Portugal. not doing this. We're not it's doing this. It's a battle of matchups. We're not and this doing fits this. fits Portugal because we're Portugal not. is not going to have a lot of possession, and that's way better for them. Rafael Leal has an, is the best counterattacking player in this tournament, and this is his type of game. Pa- match that with KDB is the best counterattacking player in the tournament. But. I mean, match that with Cristiano Ronaldo and maybe Joan Felix or someone who's on the other side. It's going to destroy France's defense and portugal i think is defensively way more sound than france no 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 i so, think so. saliba upamecano been good partnership so far nuno mens diaz pepe nuno mens is not defensively, defensively solid he's, he's defensively very, sound. i re- really diego dallo you could say diago diego dallo you could say Cancelo. you can say Semedo instead of nuno Mate, mens. you just named mad fullbacks who aren't known for their defensive abilities dallo is not defensive come on mate are not we, really, what are we mate. talking about here? Not really, man. He's been like, immense. He's, he's been solid. Better, almost Portugal's best player as well. He's solid. Paulinha at, at CDM. They got Neves at CDM can put in a shift as well. I think this is the perfect matchup for Portugal, honestly. I don't see France beating Portugal. Bro, I do not see Portugal beating... Do you, do you hear what you're saying right now? This is yes. France, bro. This is bro, France. I know France have not been... They weren't at their best in the group they stages. They But did you, two Portugal games. were stinking it, bro. Portugal were sticking it up. This is the same Portugal we saw at the World Cup. This That's, is the not, same. True. That's it not true. It is. hundred no, percent true. They've, they're, they've it's, been proved. I'm not they've backing improved. Roberto Martinez ever in my life. They've ever. He ruined a golden I'm generation budging, single-handedly. Bro. I'm not budging. Portugal is winning. They're beating France. Wow. All right, I'm so not I, budging. They, I had the Netherlands pick, so I have to, I'm have. i going to give you this one. Okay. But this is a stinker. Nah, it's I was, not. You're gonna, we're going to see I'm it. I'm going to mark my words. Portugal is going to beat France. Oh my I'm God. telling you. All right. Netherlands, Austria. Mad one. You know, mad one. I actually like this matchup. I have Austria going through. I don't, honestly, I think this is where Netherlands road ends. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I I like Austria. I think like Sabitzer Austria is well. playing out of his skin. Arnautovic, you know, when he wants to try, I don't know about Arnautovic, when bro. he wants to try, he's a top. He's a top striker. He's a top player, bro. He's technical. He can finish. Um, I just think that the squad in general is is solid. They're playing well. R- Ralph at the wheel. So yeah, I'm agree with you. Austria going right. through. Ferris. England, Switzerland. <laughs> it's going to be tough, but I think, I think Switzerland. I think we have to go Switzerland, bro. This is where England's road has to end. I agree. This is where it has to end, bro. Listen, all the English fans who are going to be in our comments talking about some Get rubbish. Get in the comments. Please tell us you all know the rubbish deep you down, want. You know deep down England 
has been so bad that Reek. you know Switzerland's got a chance. Reek, bro. Gareth Southgate, it's time to go. This is this is over. Stop ruining. Stop wasting time. Stop wasting this young talent that you have in England. It's ridiculous. You need to go. This is where your road ends, and Switzerland are going through. 100%. Two upsets in a row there. Fairs. Let's go. All right. And now let's go to the semifinal. Germany, Portugal. Now this is simple. You made it simple because you picked Portugal over <laughs> France. You made it simple. I, I agree. I think Germany wins. All right, fair enough. You know what I'm saying? Like this is I don't I don't think it'll be easy though. I think there's gonna be a lot of nil nil I think it's extra time. Uh, maybe it won't point. be it'll be a lot of complaining from Ronaldo, it'll be a lot of maybe diving from hater. Bruno. You're a hater. <laughs> You're a hater, bro. Simple um, as and I think Musiala is gonna tear him up because he's that guy. So Germany into the final in Germany. And Austria versus Switzerland's crazy. You a know? crazy semifinal. You know what I'm saying? We got Switzerland on paper is the better team. Yeah. On the field, Austria is the better team. So, so far, I would agree. But I think Switzerland are going to win this, bro. I think they're going to win it. For some reason, I, I just, I just I'm convinced, bro. I'm just convinced. The thing is, like, yeah, Xhaka has been playing really well. But, like, can they rely on Shakiri that much? It's not about Shakiri, bro. Shakiri is not Bolo that guy. hasn't been that good. Ndoy has been impressive. Ndoy has probably been the, the breakout attacker for me. In, in the Euros. He's been he's been a threat throughout the whole 90 minutes that he's been playing. He, I mean, he's Ambolo has been starting in Doi, Froehler, Xhaka, Fabian Schaar, Sommer, it's a Rodriguez. Good team, it's bro. a good team. It's a good team. And I don't think Austria can have enough against Switzerland. I, I, I don't think so, bro. Um, I'm okay with Switzerland. I like Switzerland. You know, I don't think any... It can, I, to be honest, I think this is a coin toss. And this is, you know... This is a coin toss. This is Albania 2.0. This is Albania's second team. So <laughs> we got Switzerland in the yeah, final, bro. Switzerland versus Germany in the final. I think the final's in Berlin, maybe. I'm I not sure. Um, but yeah, this is a good final. Is it a good final? It will be. It should be. I mean, if Switzerland are, you know, going to be up for the up for the task. I think whoever fin- whoever beat Whoever finished on top on the top half was always going to win. It. Yeah, yeah. I mean that that top half of the of the bracket is obviously much stronger. I agree, and I, I just think Germany's going to have what it takes. And we got to stay consistent from what we picked in our original prediction video. And we got Germany winning the Euros. You know what I'm saying? A shocker, low key, a shocker because Germany two years ago stinking it up, stinking I it up at the it World was, Cup. What was it, the game against France convinced me already? That kickoff glitch with Tony Cruz oh, and Verts. Yeah. Was that like a friendly? That was a friendly, right? It was a friendly, but yeah. that was the first time we properly saw like a setup. When we Germany. saw Nagelsmann cooking. And we saw, yeah, that was that was GG's for me when Na- I saw that. And it's in Germany, bro. Like, yeah, they got the support. Just simple as. They got the support. They got the players. They got the form. Everything's lining up for Germany to win this Euros. You know what I'm saying? That's our predictions. Fair play. Group predictions. Let's GGs. see. Let's see who messes messed it up at the end. You know what I'm <laughs> saying? Get in the comments. Let us know your predictions. Hit the like button. Sub up as well. And we'll catch you all next time. Peace. Peace.